Hey everyone, me and Mudahar, and uh, uh, we're doing a little uh, Let's Play or uh, Mudahar Plays, and uh, I wanted to play some Deus Ex, um, because I recently played a shit ton of Human Revolution, alright? And if you don't know what that game is, do yourself a favor, go out and buy it if you have PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, PC, whatever. But yeah, I played a whole ton of that, and I wanted to play the original Deus Ex, because I heard a lot of good things about it. So, I mean, here I am playing it. I said, since I'm playing it, I might as well play it with you guys, you know? So, yeah. So, without much ado, we're just going to get started with some day sex. And if you want more of these, I can make, you know, more. I don't even care, like... Well, I do care if I'm making them, alright? Like, it has to be, like... I don't know. I mean, like, whatever. So, we'll start off with these. But, yeah, I can make a lot more of these if you guys want them. Because, after all, this channel is run on what you guys want, not you know, what I necessarily want. Because then again, you guys are the ones watching it. And I'm pretty sure I can trust all you guys and gals to uh, give me some awesome games to play, not not pieces of crap. Like, uh, so let's give him a real name. Let's give him Mudahar. So there's my name. I'm not going to give a last name or anything. Leave that a mystery. So uh, obviously I've uh, invested in computer electronics and lockpicking. Not because I played this game before, but because I wanted to invest in these due to the fact that in Human Revolution you actually need them a whole lot. Not necessarily these skills, but you're dealing with computers the whole time. So, uh, let's start this game up. So yeah. I'm not gonna skip any cutscenes or anything because, like I said, I'm totally new to this game, so I wanna play it as well, you know? So let's start it up. Your appointment to FEMA should be finalized within the week. I have already discussed the matter with the Senator. I take it he was agreeable? He didn't really have a choice. Has he been infected? Oh, yes. What? Most certainly. When I mentioned that we could put him on Ambrosia. the priority list for the Ambrosia vaccine, he was so willing it was almost pathetic. That's this play, odd. the rioting is intensifying to the point where we may not be able to contain it. Why contain it? Let it spill over to the schools you and churches sick. Let the bodies Fuck. pile up in the streets. In the end, they'll beg us to save them. I've received reports of armed attacks on shipments. There's not enough vaccine to go around, and the underclasses are starting to get desperate. Of course they're desperate. They can smell their death, and the sound they'll make rattling their cage will serve as a warning to the rest. Hmm. I hope you're not underestimating the problem. The others may not go as quietly as you think. Intelligence indicates they're behind the problem. Well, that's in Paris. sick. We might get to go to Paris in this game. At running the world. But the world has been behind long ago. We. Whoa, what happened to the Statue of Liberty, man? We have other problems. You He's got his go. head clean blown off. Oh, executive shit. order after the terror strike on the statue. It's messed I have up. someone in place, though. I'm more concerned about Savage. He relocated to Vandenberg. Our biochem corpus is far in advance of theirs, as is our electronic sentience. And their ethical inflexibility has allowed us to make progress in areas they refuse to consider. The augmentation project? <gasps> augmentation! Other things, but I must admit that I have been somewhat disappointed in the performance of the primary unit. You know, you know one Second thing I don't get? Adam Jensen had the best augmentations ever. You couldn't even tell he was augmented the first time you look at him. But these guys have like blue veins sticking out of their faces. So it's like either augmentation is just de-evolved completely. I don't know. It's like, what the hell is sticking out of his head? That wasn't... You age. Aquinas spoke of the mythical city on the hill. Soon, that city will be a reality, and we crown his So, king. basically, these guys are the sick fucks and myths. Whoa. I love the music. So, yeah, anyways, uh... I could basically do a uh, Let's Play or Mudahar Play series of any other games, like, uh... Metal so Gear and stuff. Your Metal Gear Solid 1. But yeah, anyways, let's move on to this. So we're on Liberty Island. Ooh, what's this? Oh. So we're on Liberty... I get it! So basically we're in New York, Liberty Island, uh, I don't know, UNATCO HQ or some shit, so... oh, there's some trash. Yeah, there's still trash on it. Oh, whoa! What's this? I thought you were in Hong Kong. Welcome to the Coalition, JC. I might as well start using your code. Oh, so he's your brother, dude. Think That's... I missed my brother's first day? Didn't think you'd have a choice. What's going on? NSF. They hit one of our shipments. A few of them got away, but we trapped the rest in the statue. What are we waiting for? Looks like a textbook assault. The NSF took one of our agents hostage. That's sexy. The bots are holding the perimeter, but my orders are to hold back and send you in alone. 
I think someone high up wants to see how you handle the situation. All I've got with me is a pistol and an electric prod. I don't mind a test, but Unaco better issue some hardware. Remember that we're police. Stick with the prod. It'll stun your opponents or knock them unconscious. A non-lethal takedown is always the most silent way to eliminate resistance. Just ah, yeah, whatever. Okay, so we can either take a sniper rifle, a gep gun, which I assume is some badass motherfucking BFG gun, okay? Uh, the crossbow. Uh, I'll take the rifle. Maybe it's uh, I don't know. I like to pick him off from it. This isn't a training exercise. I got a sniper. Rifle. Oh man, I thought it was a crank beings. rifle. Keep that in mind. No I shit, dude. Idea. I'm going to give you a map of the island. If you can get to the north dock, a Unatco informant will give you a key to the statue doors. He responds to the code phrase "iron and copper." I'll see how it looks. Your primary objective is to make sure you <sighs> send it. What are my orders when I reach the command center? Interrogate the leader. We don't yet know. Okay, cool. All right, so we're gonna basically what's going on is that there's some uh, bad guys in the statue. Over oh, what the fuck? There's some bad. There's some bad guys in that statue. All right. And, uh, you know, there's some hardcore motherfuckers. They attacked us right on our home turf, so we basically gotta go there and, uh, take shit out. I hope that sums it up. Oh, we got a crowbar! So, as much as I've learned from Half Life, smacking a box will get you items. But doing that in Resident Evil 4 might get you snakes. So, you. What's your take on the situation? The box? I, I, I don't. I, I don't wanna talk to this guy. What? Okay, let's go on. Those are just like robots, so... What the fu Those are even weaker than the ones in human... Ro what? It's like everything took a step back. NSF everywhere, JC. Your orders are to shoot on sight. Okay, first you tell me that you want this to be a stealth operation. Now you're like, shoot shit up. Identify yourself with the phrase, iron and copper. Fuck you, I'm not looking for him. I'm gonna find my way in without looking for the bum. Yeah, let's see, because this game gives you a shit ton of freedom. Remember the Academy stealth course. Stay out of their field of view, walk slowly to stay quiet, and crouch behind cover. Or if you have to get your hands dirty, remember that a headshot is a lethal takedown. Oh, really? I would not have known that. Next time, remember to shoot him in the head, because that's an instant kill. Oh, so, just, so we're gonna we're gonna stay far away from him, because uh, we can do that. Okay, so I should totally stay right here. This game, this game is pretty cool. Eh? I like the atmosphere stuff, you know? It's, it's definitely a refresher from uh, all the other shooters and stuff out these days. Again, uh, if you got. Honestly, I gotta tell you, uh, Deus Ex is one of, I think, my favorite series. Like, I think Human Revolution was one of the best games released this generation, to be honest. And if you guys haven't played it, go go get it right now. Just, just stop what Go get it. Just believe in what I say, okay? Alright? Just, just believe. Okay, so we got one guy here. Oh, two, two guys. <laughs> That's the difference right there. Oh, let's listen in. Look at him. Man, cut off his arm, placed half his face. Hmm. Right. He's a good soldier. Killed three of our men. They'd have replaced his whole body if it would have improved performance. That's how you judge a man by performance. Then eventually, it's not about people, but upgrades, versions, functionality. All I know is we could use a few mechs for ops like this. As soon as we buy into the cult of the machine, we're just like them. Rhetoric. Always more rhetoric. Oh, dude! This is sick! If you guys don't know, in Deus Ex, there's this whole, like, sort of technology versus morality stuff. Like, uh, you know, are, are we playing God or some stuff like that, you know? I'm not gonna get too into it, just, just play the game and read about it yourself. Like, it's, it's a whole, it's a huge mythos. It's really interesting. These guys are from some cult or something. Not not from a cult. But they don't they don't like machines. So I I, I don't know what to call them. I, I think they're like terrorist Amish folks. Now, now, if one of my viewers is Amish, I'm really sorry. I mean I'm just I'm just trying to you know to, to give to give you guys a plausible. Oh my god! I can't see shit. I should turn up the brightness. But anyway, I'm just trying to you know give you a uh, an, an uh, example. There we go. That's the word. So there's one guy like you fuck, we're just gonna go down here. What's this? I'm sick and tired of just fucking crouch walking, okay? Oh shit, there's one guy down there. So I don't know, I'm gonna bring out my uh What the fuck is it? Oh this is oh is this like an electric dildo or something? What what is this? It's gonna like uh vibrate the shit out of him. Oh shit! 